right so straight into today's video you're going to need a bowl and you guys already know my trusty bamboo bowl i always use this bowl for diys you're going to need one tablespoon of extra virgin olive oil one and a half tablespoons of organic agave nectar and one cup of greek yogurt and i'm just using the plain one that has whole milk you'll also need one can of organic coconut milk and here i'm just using one tablespoon of the flawless exotic oil by gabrielle union but here you can substitute and use whatever you have um, i didn't have jojoba oil or else that would have been my first choice but this is what i had on hand so that's what i used then you'll need one tablespoon of lemon so i just cut it in half and squeeze the one side and then for the star of the show which is amazing and it reminds me of home so much in st croix is the pink guava powder of course not the powder but of the fruit itself we used to eat that all the time in my grandmother yard so anyway this is the star of the show and now you'll need some measuring spoons a hand mixer and a measuring cup all right ayo so let we start so the first thing i did which i didn't record was that i took the organic coconut milk and i refrigerated for 24 hours just because i wanted to separate the liquids from the fat because what you're actually going to do is to turn the coconut milk upside down and when you open it strain the liquid and scoop out the fat because it's the fat that we need then you'll want to combine the greek yogurt and guava fruit powder using a hand mixer until the consistency is very smooth which is what you see me doing here so you see me here just mixing with the hand mixer just to make sure everything is fully combined and then i go back in with the spoon again to scrape the sides of the bowl just to make sure that everything is getting fully combined and together for the next step. so once you're done mixing your guava and greek yogurt you're just going to cover those with saran wrap or foil paper and let it sit in the fridge for about an hour until you make your coconut mixture all right now on to the second part so you'll just want to put your coconut fat and the reason why mine doesn't look solidified is because i let it sit out the fridge for this consistency then i'm just adding my olive oil my organic agave nectar and my exotic oil by gabrielle union now once you have everything in the bowl, you'll just take a spoon and mix everything together just to make sure everything is fully combined and you don't see those streaks of oils, you know, floating to the top. Now once that is all done, you combine the two and you just really mix everything together and you're going to see this conditioner come to life right in front of your eyes but enjoy this slow-mo of this coconut milk all right pour. you guys <laughs> so in the description box below it would have the full recipe and it would also have some alternatives that you guys can use monet put those together for you guys just in case you don't have everything that i'm using in the video right now so the way how this guava concoction came up is because i had the pink guava powder in my pantry and i was actually using it to make some smoothies but i was also reading the benefits of guava powder and guava leaf for your hair and it is incredible i'll definitely have those in the description box so below. anyway i picked up my phone and i called monet and i gave her the idea and she loved it and of course monet did her formulations and she came back with the most perfect conditioner that i've ever used like an actual diy conditioner i have ever used so i want you guys to try it out you can actually see here in these clips how dry my hair is like really dry so once i put in this deep conditioner you're going to see how it lays my hair down i even had to facetime monet in the middle of recording because i had to show her like yo this thing <laughs> ain't a joke like you could see my face here like yes like yes monet so monet thank you again for everything because this formulation and all your formulations are just perfect all right so enough of me talking and now just enjoy the slow-mo clips that are coming up Thank you. 
Are you seeing this? Are you see how amazing my hair look after using this deep conditioner? Like I had seen my hair prior. Okay, it was a big fluff ball. There was no curl pattern. My hair was completely stretched out. So now having all these curls just clumped together, like this is amazing. I tell you, just go ahead and do it. Please do it and tag me on the social media platforms. I'll definitely leave that down below in the description box for you guys as well. And follow me if you don't follow me. So here I was showing you guys that I told you to leave it on for 45 minutes but I actually left this in my hair for going on an hour and a half and then I just went in the shower and I rinsed it all out. Alright you guys, so this is my hair straight out of the shower from using the guava mask. My hair feels extremely soft. I hope you guys try this conditioner out. My hair was very dry before. So to have this kind of, you know, moisture and hydration right out the shower, I am so impressed. Again, Monet with the formulation. <laughs> A big thumbs up and thank you again because you just you don't always date right so let's get into styling guys I wanted to come on camera and show you guys what my hair looks like when I go to sleep or or how I do my hair before bed so I usually put it up in this pineapple so that I can keep my ends um like right in front of me i usually add upon a bonnet to cover the ends but because my hair gains so long to fit in the bonnet i leave it out because the bonnet is like so tight on my ends that it'll like squish up my end them <laughs> it'll scrunch my ends so this is why i recommend you guys get a silk pillowcase this helps me a lot so i want you guys to tag me in your satin pillowcase just so we could all be on the same page and make sure each of us are taking care of our hair at night especially at night when we sleep in on those cotton sheets and those could really tug on our ends and make it really dry but as you can see my ends still look nice and fresh so i want to see our pillowcase so make sure you tag me in it on instagram or on facebook i leave my handle names down here at the bottom of the screen so you guys can see what it is and follow me if you don't follow me Let's get into loosening out these twists. Alright you guys, thank you so much for watching today's video. I will take care of yourself. Take care of your people lamb. One love. Like that